After years of pain, unanswered questions, and invisible battles, there comes a turning point. Endometriosis may not yet have a cure, but science, resilience, and compassion have changed the course of its story. This is where treatment begins. Because estrogen fuels the growth of endometriotic tissue, the first step is often to quiet its influence. Hormonal therapy becomes the body's recalibration, turning down the volume on chaos. Oral contraceptives smooth the hormonal waves. Progestin-only treatments suppress ovulation and thin the uterine lining. Meanwhile, GnRH agonists and antagonists bring the body into a temporary, reversible menopause, starving lesions of their fuel. But each therapy is a balance between relief and side effects, between silence and suppression. For some, it brings peace. For others, only a pause. When estrogen production persists locally, aromatase inhibitors step in, blocking the enzyme at its source. These therapies target the biochemical engine of endometriosis itself. Alongside them, NSAIDs like ibuprofen ease the inflammation that radiates through the pelvis. Pain subsides, not by masking it, but by slowing the storm beneath. When medication is not enough, surgery becomes both art and necessity. Through laparoscopy, keyhole incisions no larger than a pearl, surgeons navigate the hidden terrain of pain. They remove lesions, release adhesions, and restore the natural anatomy of the pelvis. For many women, this can mean relief from pain and renewed fertility. But endometriosis is resilient. Even after surgery, it can return. A reminder that this battle is chronic, not terminal. For some, pregnancy brings an unexpected reprieve. High levels of progesterone and reduced estrogen create a hostile environment for endometriotic growth. Lesions shrink, pain fades, the immune system calms. But this peace is temporary. After childbirth, as cycles resume, so can the symptoms. Pregnancy is not a cure. It is nature's brief truce. The long-term path of endometriosis is as individual as the women who live with it. For some, symptoms fade. For others, they return with quiet persistence. But every year brings new understanding, molecular targets, gene therapies, and regenerative approaches once unthinkable. What was once an invisible disease is now seen, studied, and spoken about. And in that visibility lies power. With menopause, estrogen levels fall, and the fire of endometriosis burns low. Lesions shrink, inflammation subsides, and many finally find relief. Yet for a few, remnants may linger, dormant, sometimes reawakened by hormone therapy. Even then, vigilance replaces fear, because understanding transforms suffering into strength. Endometriosis is not a life sentence. It's a story of biology, rewritten by knowledge, courage, and care. From pain to awareness, from silence to science, the more we understand, the closer we move to a cure. And to the millions living with it, you are not alone. The future is already beginning within you.